Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, and welcome back to Deator Productions, and welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3. Last episode, we met a few friends, crashed an autoloid, and nearly ended up floor pizza. But with some magical shenanigans, we landed safely. So let's work out where we are, refind our friends. Let's jump in. As you wake, the tadpole squirms in your skull. So, uh, we're alive. Surprise, surprise. Um, and we are going to try and work out where we are. The chaos of the crash site confuses the landscape. You'll need to find a settlement or landmark, and you'll need to do it quickly. The tadpole is a death sentence, and the clock is ticking. You need a cure. So, we are here. We are on a beach. Everything is on fire. What's over here? Nothing. Got it. Many quests have been completed and we have many new quests. Hey look, a shadow heart. Now, uh, let's wake Shadowheart up. Mm. You're alive. I'm alive. How is this possible? Purple magically wibbliness. I was hoping you might know that. I remember the ship. I remember falling. Then nothing. Well, now what? First things first. We need supplies, shelter, and most of all, a healer. We might have escaped, but we still have these little monsters in our heads. Ah, oh, they're adorable. Uh, we want to stay together. We need each other. And we both know what's at stake. Can't think of better company. Let's get moving. One thing. Just before we go. I wanted to thank you again. For freeing me. That's all it right. would have been all too easy for you to run right past my pod, but you didn't. I'll remember that. Thank you, friend. Lead the way. Okay. More of that. Another dead. I don't like that noise. Okay, so now we've been through, we've cleared the beach, and we have. Um, just uh, sorted our inventory, sent everything back to the camp that we didn't need. Uh, one of the mods isn't quite. Oh, combat! I did see my initiative was four. And I failed the save against switching. Maybe this shield. Everything is on fire again. Fucking damn it. Shoot the intellect of error. And then you turn, I guess. God damn it. Maybe the, that shield of twisting vines was a bad idea. And the thing's on fire. Can I just hit the thing? It moved into melee range, so yes, I can hit it. I missed. Dash, dash, dash. Uh, we will throw a fireball. Firebolt, sorry. Need the stuka? You fight well. Perhaps our survival isn't such a distant prospect. Okay, so, um, we'll do the level up in a bit. We're gonna wait until we have a few more people so we can do it all at once, just to save a bit of time. Let's try and get inside this wooden trunk. Yeah, it's locked. With a flick of the wrist. There we go. Uh, I'm not gonna bother adding a bonus, because I should nail this. 
What's in here? Uh, leather helmet. And uh, I think Shadow Heart can wear the leather helmet. Because what does her. That does nothing. There you go, Shadow Heart. Now you get plus one to your deck saving throws. What we got around here then? Anything awesome? No. Hello. Over here. This is uh, it's just a different way to get No, this is a new place. We'll go back in there in a minute. But we now have to speak to a steady. Something to ask. Hurry. I've got one of those brain things called. Do you friend? Do you really? In the grass. You can kill it, can't you? Like you killed the others? Kill it yourself. You look capable enough. I was hoping for a kind soul. Well, not to worry. You cheeky shit basket. Slip the hold. I have advantage. And it's ten. I should not fail this. Didn't. Twenty-one. Silly elf. I saw you on the ship, strutting about whilst I was trapped in that pot. What did you and those tentacled freaks do to me? Uh, I did nothing, friend. You have it backwards. They snatched me I'm up too. I'm not an idiot. I saw- ah! Your mind twists. You're looking out of unfamiliar eyes, prowling dark, busy streets. Ooh. You try to hold the memory, but it fades to the worm. The light. The fear. <laughs> what was that? What's going on? Shenanigans. Uh, Mind flare where I'm it connected us. The worm. Of course. That explains things somewhat. And to think, I was ready to decorate the ground with your innards. <laughs> Apologies. Apologies. Oh, he's such a nice boy. Uh, I might have done the same thing if the roles uh -huh. were reversed. A kindred spirit. Even though I only have a hit and stick. My name's Astarian. Astarian. I was in Baldur's Gate when those beasts snatched me. Uh, tell him my name and my story. My, my. You've been busy. So, did you learn anything about these worms while wandering the ship? Uh, only we don't want them in our heads. No. Of that much, we can be certain. These worms are already affecting me. I can feel it. Now, what to do about it? Uh, travel together. Better you know, odds, I say. I was ready to go this alone. But maybe sticking with the herd isn't such a bad idea. And anyone that can crash a mind flare ship and walk away seems like a good person to know. All right, I accept. Lead on. Boom. So that's where I was already. Go look at the map. If we come out of here, go sh straight up. That's where we came in. There, go. a mind flayer, and it's hurt. That thing's bound to be dangerous, even if injured. Let's be careful. In that case, wait. Yeah, let's just kill it. Monster. It's for the best. Death is too good for it. Anything to loot? No. So, oh, okay. So if we went out this door, that's just back to where Asterion was. I want to keep holding shift to try and run faster. It's not how the game works. Um, if we go out of this door here. That's just fire. Ooh, goblins. Dead goblins over there. Worth checking for supplies, maybe. What's that? Okay, we'll go and 
This is this is weird. Approach the sigil on the stone. Magic glitters and swirls from it erratically, as if malfunctioning. It looks slightly dangerous. Touch it. Of course, I'm going to touch it. That was a bad idea. Got it. Yeah. A hand? Anyone? Okay, friend. Um, slap it. Ow. <laughs> Perhaps I should have clarified. Mm -hmm. Helping and anyone? Okay. Uh, pull him out. Seven. I should should be able to do this fine. Nailed it. That's it. Go on. Yes, Keep grab going. the bracer that is perfectly attached to his arm. Gale of Waterdeep. Apologies. I'm usually better at this. Um. At introductions? At magic. Ah, that makes Say, sense. But I know you, don't I? In a manner of speaking. You were on the Nautiloid as well. Yes, friend. Uh, never mind the Nautiloid. How did you get stuck in that stone? I don't stone? know what transpired exactly, but the ship broke into pieces and I suddenly found myself in freefall. So I was plummeting to certain death, I spied a glimmer quite near where I estimated my body to impact with less than savory propulsion. Hims uses fancy this words. Glimmer to be magical in nature, I reached out to it with a weaving of words and found myself on the other side, as it were. How about you? How did you survive the fall? Uh, landed it safely and saved the day. That vast burning wreckage behind <laughs> you is a somewhat controversial story, but here you stand. So who am I to argue? Still, swashbuckling heroics aside, I have the unfortunate suspicion your survival is still very much in jeopardy. Back on the ship, you too were on the receiving end of a rather unwelcome insertion in the ocular region. Were you not? Uh, couldn't have phrased it more appellantly myself. No you sugarcoating it, is there? The insertee we speak of, this parasite? Are you aware that after a period of excruciating Ruciating gestation, it will turn us into mind flayers. It's a process known as ceramorphosis, and let me assure you, it is to be avoided. Got it. You don't happen to be a cleric by any chance, do you? A doctor? Surgeon? Uncannily adroit with a knitting needle? No. You seem to know enough about our condition to realize it's beyond most clerics' skills. Most? No doubt. But I find myself hoping to be in the presence of the few. <laughs> you don't happen to be one of them. No. Can't say that I am. We're most certainly going to need a healer. And soon, too. How about we lend each other a helping hand once more and look for a healer together? Okay. Welcome to join me. Most excellent. A parasite shared is a parasite halved. If only it was that easy. Oh. But before you think you're about to embark on a journey with most ill-mannered a man, thank you for pulling me out of that stone. It was an act of foresighted kindness, I assure you. For I have the feeling ample opportunities will present themselves for me to return the favor. Ta-da! Um, so we will discover the waypoint. Ooh, a rogue's morsel. Don't grab that. Room for more. Um, where do we want to go first? Do we want to check out the this? No, we'll save this place, the the chapel, for next time. We will go and find Lizelle again before we do anything else. Which is, if I remember correctly, somewhere over here. 
You think it's dangerous? Zoru was right. Yellow as a toad, and twice as ugly. That's a dick. The thing's dangerous. Leave it for the goblins to kill. And if it escapes, how will you... Oh, a guest. Hi, friend. Your skull pounds in response to the prisoner's white-hot stare. Her lips don't move, yet you hear her voice. Get rid of them. Um... Let us converse civilly. Nailed it. Converse with it. I barely know what it is. Say the same about you, friend. But Demise, if it's intelligent, we can't just... Hells, this isn't worth it. I'm out of here. Enough gawking. Get me down. Uh, now they're out of a shot, sure. Let's let them leave for a while. Uh, Observe, shoot the bottom of this listen. thing. You hear goblins or you see them. I didn't As even, like... The tadpole hasn't yet scrambled all your senses. Auspicious. Yay. But the longer we wait, the more it consumes. My people possess the cure for this infection. I must find a crash. You will join me. Will I now? She obviously sees your kindness as weakness. Don't let her take advantage. Uh, and what exactly is a crash? It is many things. A hatchery, a training grounds, a shelter. Githyanki protocol is clear. When infected with a gay tadpole, we must report to Augustil for purification. Okay, friend. Simple thank you wouldn't go amiss. You may amiss. as well suggest a wyvern bow to worms. The cure I offer will suffice as thanks. Let's, let's go you find the crash. You have made an ally from Kresh Kalir. Few know such fortune. Call me Lazel. I know, the game told me I'll that already. Judgment. Plus, I've played enough her. of this to know what your stupid name Not is. Until I've gotten the measure of her. That's fair. You have a sharp tongue, elf. Would that your mind proved its equal. Half elf. I suppose the finer details are lost on a creature like you. Yeah. Come. The Horned Ones mentioned a camp. One there, this Zoru, has seen Githyanki. A crash must be near. We will ask this Zoru where he has seen my kin. And doop. So, the last thing we will do today is quickly run through all of the level ups. Monk level two. So now I get an extra key point that I haven't even used yet. And when I'm not wearing armor, I can use move another 10 feet. I get patient defense, step of the wind, and disengage. And one of the mods that I have lets me get more feet. One of them, again, is a mod. Which is this one, which gives me proficiency in three and ability to increase my ability score by one. But for now, I think, if I get mobile, then I can just even move even more. Another 10 feet, just so I can sprint around like a lunatic. And Shadowheart Cleric, level 2. Uh, change her spells. So we will... Um, what have we got? Bless, create or destroy water... Yeah, we'll leave everything as it is for now on her spells, and we will get her Weapon Master so that I can get her with a Greatsword, because I always prefer Shadow Heart with a big get this heavy crossbow as well. And a longbow and a longsword. Yeah, and then we will get her strength up. Asterian Rogue level 2. He basically just gets a feat. We will get him alert so he can always uh, never be surprised and gets plus 5 to his initiative. We 
wizard. I think we will keep him in evocation. Um. Do, 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 do. And he can learn chromatic orb and what's a good one? Ray of sickness. That is good for that. And we will swap sleep and grease for the two new spells and we will get him warcaster lets him yes use shocking grasp so he can actually do some like <sighs> magic -y better stuff uh Lizelle, we will give sentinel so that if anyone attacks someone else she's still close to she can smack him That is our level ups done. So we're going to try and end here every uh, video when we can at our camp. Just because it's a nice peaceful place away from all the chaos of the world. Thank you for uh, watching today. If you check out all the links in the description, mainly the link tree, everything is there all together just to make life nice and easy for you. Uh, check out the streams over on here on YouTube and on Twitch. You know roughly what the schedule is. Mondays for now is Starfield. Wednesdays is Planet Crafter. Fridays is something with Trip. Be it whatever we end up playing. And then Saturdays is D&D. &D. So come back next time where we shall continue our adventure. Thank you very much. Dear Tour. Out.